I was born with a strange gift. The ability to see what no human being has ever seen before. So it's about this girl um, named Jody, and from the moment she's born, she experiences this uh, gift she has, this, this entity that, that surrounds her, something that she can communicate with and that no one else, you know, can understand. So this thing is your friend, and he's connected to you with some kind of cord. Is he here right now? And this entity, you know, protects her and cares about her, but it also interferes with her life. It's the new me, and... You might as well just give up, Aiden. This date is going on. So she has this love-hate relationship with this thing that is constantly surrounding her. Can you tell him to do something? Tell him what to do, and it happens. I don't tell Aiden what to do. No one does. He's like a lion in a cage. We're tied together. He can't go away. I start out as a, basically a researcher, and I start working with this little girl, and we have parallel tracks because she turns out to be a very gifted little girl. The story itself is, is very, you know, the concept is huge, and there's, you know, incredible action. I mean, incredible action sequences and locations all over the world, and but there's also this beautiful drama within it, you know, and how she relates to herself and Aiden and other people in the world and the journey she's going on to kind of break through what's been holding her back to just be herself and be in control of her own life. I do everything you ask of me all week and I never get to have any fun. For the hundredth time, you're not like everyone else and there are rules. Well, I didn't ask to be different. I just want to go out and, and have friends and be like other girls my age. You'll never be like them. You need to get used to that. Not only am I a surrogate father, but I start to see how I can use her for my particular agenda. <laughs> so uh, it's a complicated um, relationship they have, and it develops uh, over a long period of time. It's weird, because I think like, anyone can relate to that. Anyone can relate to um, getting rid of our own kind of personal demons to live and be truly present and free, you know? Thank you.